Right now, one of Baltimore's most beloved attractions is getting underway. The annual Artscape Festival celebrates the creative side of Charm City. WJZ is live at Mount Royal. Pat Warren reports with more on the event billed as the biggest free arts festival in the country. And Pat, it is not a scorcher today, thank goodness. I was going to tell you we have broken with tradition and it's not the hottest day of the year. Very enjoyable. We're in the heart of 17 blocks of fun for everyone. Artscape billing itself is something no one person can do everything of. The tents are up, the art is on, and the people are out to enjoy it. Artscape is a one-of-a-kind adventure in eye candy and craftsmanship, not to mention entertainment. What does this say about Baltimore? It says it all. It says what's positive about our city. Take a look around. You can see it's a great mix of people, new friends, old friends, all coming together to celebrate Baltimore. And it's all centered on the arts, which makes it even better. It's history. Absolutely perfect day in Baltimore. With food almost as good to look at as it is to eat. Escape is beautiful. And lights up when the sun sets, like this exhibit by Nathan Towles, sponsored by Artscape partner Horseshoe Casino. On the branches, there are also pixels, and you'll get to really um, bask in that later this evening. It's going to be quite a sight for the eyes. We thought this year our theme would be the year we didn't have a theme and kind of get back to basics, really celebrating what makes Artscape so special. Where else can you have an ice cream and an empanada and be serenaded by wonderful music? And it's free. The fun continues through 9 tonight, opens at 11, closes at 9 tomorrow, Saturday, and runs from 11 to 7 on Sunday. So plenty of opportunities to come down and see what this is all about. I'm Pat Warren reporting live back to you. All right, Pat, thank you. Festival organizers suggest that you check the website for the best way to experience the festival.